What is good, y'all? It's your girl Nancy here, and I just went through hell, like for real, with all this shipping stuff. <laughs> and I'm just like so done with it, bro. But um, today at work, well, I mean this morning was something else. It's just something to deal with, but it's whatever, you know, a little day by day. But anyways, though. That one's shitty and good at the same damn time. But, um, yeah, for what the shipping is going on right now, I'm uh, waiting on a phone call back for my main item that I'm really worried about. But, uh, call FedEx and have to call five times, or about four times, for somebody to give me some answers. Because every one of them. Do not want to help me out at all. Like they ain't want to give me no info. Tell me why. Tell me what it is. They are completely wrong to act, um, answer. Like I did not say shit about their items they sent me in the mail. They are completely 100% avoiding act the answer. Basically, like oh I don't know what that is. Oh I don't know what to talk about. This and that. Blah blah blah. I'm just going ahead and come up with something else and avoid that. <laughs> so, yeah, they didn't want to talk about it at all. I was giving them all the details and they just did not want to talk about it. They didn't want to have nothing to do with it, basically. So, our person is saying, the last person I talked to basically saying they don't send nothing like that out. It's probably some type of scam thing or whatever. And they have no clue what it is. He don't know what it is. have no clue. So I'm just like, well, I'll just wait until one of y'all local offices open up and call them, see what they can do for me. But hopefully I won't have to go over there. Because that'll be right there on the highway or whatever. And yeah, those, there's no way for me to get there on the bike. So um, either I have to walk or just fucking get somebody to bring me over there, which I really don't have and whatnot, whatnot. <laughs> so I went over here and called Amazon up. Amazon go on here and say basically for the info that I gave them is that's wrong. You didn't pay extra. Shipping is free. Bullshit, bullshit. I did, I did, I did. And basically, uh, they don't know what happened with the date being changed and this and that. They apologize and blah 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 but I'm supposed to get my shit Monday and I said well if it changes again and they said just give us a call back and we'll um take care of it or whatever so if this changes one more motherfucker time bro I'm gonna be so hot so um I checked up on my other item I ordered which would be the press which is a cheap $15 press plus extra so, supposed to be coming. That's only good for my, um, yeah, my other part for my ER. So, that's the only thing that's good for. Because the way that tool is made, it fit perfectly with that press I got. Because the press is so, so low, you can't put shit on that bitch besides that thing. So, or something really tiny like a screwdriver or something like that. So, um, yeah, that'd be perfect for that. But I'll get me a bigger one once I can afford it. So, which ain't nothing but 60 or about a hundred or something dollars. So, which is well worth it. And for something I will need to get for me to do Glocks and all that mess to build and create those. But, um, and whatever else. So, um, yeah, basically, uh, that's supposed to be here on Monday too. So, guess Monday we will see if I receive all four of my items. Should be the shoes, end mill, drill bit kit, router, and the press, which should be five items. My bad. So, all those items are supposed to be here Monday. So, we'll see what happens Monday. And, um, most likely I'll be at work. And hopefully they'll deliver once I be home, which I highly doubt. So I'm actually have to call them up and see if they can drop everything off on, 
on a porch instead of out front in the door so nobody won't steal it. Kind of a few times before, they left it out front in front of the door where people can obviously steal it, take it. They don't give a fuck. As long as it's delivered, they did their job, they happy. So, um, they can say whatever they want on that paper or however they do it. And I say, I say, put it here, they put it there, you know. So, um, yeah. And that's a lot of money I pit towards these items, which would be a hundred and forty-eight, forty-seven dollars and something cent. So, yeah, that's a lot of money, but you fuck me over on that shit. Ooh, wee, I'm gonna let motherfuckers know. But, for my main item that I'm waiting on them to contact me back on, <coughs> excuse me, which should be the AR part, I gotta actually wait all the way to the 28 when it's supposed to be here on the 27 and I pay the extra $20 for it to be here on the 27. So once they call me back up, I will make another video of it, let y'all know. And, um, yeah, right now I'm catching hell on getting my business started. And I'm going to make a video on how you can get yours started or make a business or do your own thing, really, whatever. But, um, this is what I'm going through right now because of what's going on right now. And everybody trying to pit that towards what's going on right now for the late and basically from Amazon. So, uh, that's their excuse. Anyways, though, y'all have a good one. It's your girl. And I'm fucking just done with it, bitch. I'm done with it. And, uh, yeah, I have a good one, though. Peace.